The eccentric, often brilliant gnomes are held as one of the most peculiar races of the world. With their obsession for developing radical new technologies and constructing marvels of mind-bending engineering, it's a wonder that any gnomes have survived to proliferate. Over the years, the gnomes have contributed ingenious weapons to aid the Grand Alliance in its fierce battles against the Horde. Thriving within the wondrous techno-city of Nomregon, the gnomes shared the resources of the forested Dumora peaks with their dwarven cousins. Yet recently, a barbaric menace rose up from the bowels of the earth and invaded Nomregon. Aided by their dwarven allies, the gnomes fought a valiant battle to save their beloved city. Nevertheless, Nomregon was irrevocably lost. The surviving gnomes fled to the safety of the dwarven stronghold of Ironforge. There they remain, devising strategies to retake their city. As a gnome of proud standing, it falls to you to answer the challenge and lead your curious people to a brighter future. I'm standing inside a dwarf. There we go. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, hello, y'all. I'm Brushfire Wind Dragon, and welcome to Vanilla WoW. Uh, I haven't played. I started playing WoW back in 2008. So, uh. This is like, you know, going back, this is what I cut my teeth on, you know, um, uh, I didn't really get to play much of Vanilla WoW before Kata, I mean, I had like a mil I have like a million characters, no, you can only have 50, I have 50 characters, it's as many as you can have. <laughs> What was I saying? <laughs> anyway, uh, where's, uh, didn't I have, Wh where are my sub, uh, subtitles? Okay, I know you're supposed to have subtitles, like, what was I going to say? Um, I didn't get to discover all of Vanilla WoW because I came in right at Burning Crusade uh where is subtitles so I kinda wanna archive all the quests I can in Vanilla I, I know there's I know there's subtitles somewhere I just can't remember. Ah, uh, no, I don't. I don't want to worry about it. I know subtitles are a thing because the cinematic subtitles. Because I put it on one of my other vanilla characters. Hmm. Well, I'll definitely want to put it on. Okay. It's it's activated, but it didn't give me any subtitles. Okay then. Oh well, here we go. Here's Madeline, Maddie for short. I'm still developing the story. Why aren't you a sturdy-looking one? Perhaps you can assist me with a thing or two. Not much help around here except for green apprentices, and they've got other things to worry about. She's. <laughs> what do we have here? You look as though you might need something to keep your hands warm. Hmm. I'll tell you what would help, a pair of nice warm gloves, and being the kind soul that I am, I'd be more than happy to provide you with a suitable pair. I have one condition, however. I need you to go get me some wolf meat. Nice arrangement, hmm? You bring me some wolf meat, and I'll make sure you don't lose any digits to frostbite. Frostbite, well, what do you say? Eight pieces, and I'll get the rabbit handler gloves. Oh, they're green! Nice! Safe travels! 
Honestly, I mean in the actual color and not in the rarity. <laughs> uh, well, I guess, you know, actually, it's good I actually start out with shoes, though, because we're out in the snow and the, the night elves don't even start out with shoes. Got an apprentice robe, a shirt, apprentice pants, apprentice boots, a bent staff. Hey, I'm Mario. Get close enough and I'll whack you with my staff. Oh, I killed it first. <laughs> so I'm still developing Maddie's story, but it's going to, like, you know, be developed over the course of the uh, series. I don't know if I'm really gonna do battlegrounds because I've never really been able to do those. <laughs> I like these. The starting area is so bad, but once you get out of the starting area, it's like, you know, you're broke and you don't have any. Uh, enough bags. Some people are complaining that bags are just not dropping for them, and some drop pretty easily. Oh, that got tagged by somebody else. There's a wolf. So, I mean, I can still get pretty fun. And it is, you know. It's like, yeah, you have to get weapon proficiency by using the weapon and you'd have to go to trainers to uh, actually learn things instead of just, you know, learning them as you level up. Lots of stuff has changed about WoW since the beginning. Hey, Wolf! Come on! <laughs> You probably don't usually play major. <laughs> ah, I got two 120s right now, and one's a human paladin. She's actually a dragon, but and the other is a skull hunter. <laughs> Can't do anything with those leather pants. Come on, Wolfie. I'm gonna move this up here. How long does that last? Oh, that's. Oh, yeah. I'll use that. Where's the quest giver? I think I lagged a bit there. Oh, hey, I see more newbies. Or er, brand new characters. Gender locks. Jinxies. Nice. You got my attention. Love's giving you a bit of trouble. You'd do well to avoid the fangs, the claws, and other sharp bits, yes? Ah, oh, wonderful. The wolf meat should do nicely. Oh, don't worry, Madeline. I wouldn't forget my part of the bargain. Here, one of these should fit you. Ah! I swear I chose the reward already. Oh. That's no Off end. With you. Let's try again. <laughs> I can't choose a reward. That is odd. <laughs> Watch oh, your back. Dang it. Uh, I'll be right back. What can I do for ya? Now I can choose it. Don't know what happened there. Flippic memorandum. When you were helping me out, this memorandum was given me to pass on to you. Take some time to read it when you have a chance. I'm thinking it came from the range trainer Merrick. 
Take a gander at it and go find him inside Anvilmar when you have a chance. Okay? Safe travels. Great to meet you. Huh, I don't suppose you'd be willing to do me a favor at last. A stack of letters came to the pass today, but I don't have the time to send them along. They're all addressed to Talon Kenai. You can find him to the west down the road. He set up a camp next to the frozen lake. What do you say? Off with you. Now, of course, I could... You know, in um, in the retail version, I do have brush fire as a, a character. Um, but, you know, I can't remake her in vanilla WoW for hopefully obvious reasons. <laughs> What can I do for you? I hope you're here to lend us a hand, mage. After the last truck attack, we could use all the help we could get. I hear the buggers have been pop popping up all across the lands, and it seems Cold Ridge Valley is no exception. They've been spotted all over the hills to the southeast and near the frozen lake. That's not all. Just a few nights ago, they attacked and overramped our camp to the west. We're a bit short-handed here, lass, and we need strong arms to help drive the trucks back. Ah, I'm gonna get the boots. Keep your feet on the ground. Okay, let me... Oh, I'll put that on too. I'll put on my new gloves. Pretty green gloves. Oh, yeah, I should read. To new students of the arcane arts, you are required to seek out and study under the gnome Merrick Nurbit until such time comes that you are called upon to aid your people in reestablishing themselves in a new habitation. Please, without trepidation, prepare yourself for rigorous testing procedures and a difficult acclimation process. As you find a domicile and or any form of companionship with the local citizens. Di local denizens. Okay. Questions regarding your duties and abilities should be directed to Merrick Nerbit. Okay, this is not the first typo I found playing Classic, but... I'm like, which way is this supposed to be spelled? Okay. Ah, then. Ah, there's a weapon spell. Well met. Yeah. It's too expensive. I don't have any copper. <laughs> okay. But Oh, it's still here. I have it. I mean, I really had to change how I did it, but... Ugh. I'll leave those where they Take are. Travels. Thought I'd close that. Hey, Merrick! Good day to you. <laughs> yeah, what's that? No, speak up if you don't mind. I don't hear so good after a few hours. You know, it sounds weird for a gnome to call another gnome a gnome. <laughs> oh yeah, Arcane Arts, of course. Here's what you need to know, Madeline. Don't get into too much trouble. Save some coin to buy me an L, or any spells you might want. Stay the heck away from Numbergon. Other than that, have a good day. I'll be here if you ever need me, or want to train, or whatever. Off and away. Honored, I'm sure. Uh, arcane Intellect! Okay. Very good. Yay! I learned a thing! <laughs> okay. Okay, can't get Felix's quest yet. After Kata, he ended up down uh, at Whitebeard's campsite. I'm not sure why the difference. Oh man, I, I had an urge to get on my chauffeured motorbike. Oh, but I just gotta run it. <laughs> oh yeah. What I got? Uh, there we go. Ah, there it is. All the way over there. I like the sound the footsteps make, though. Although you think torn, uh, torn hooves would make more sound on stone. <laughs> There's a frozen lake. I 
Oh, there's a troll over here. Ah. That must be the trolls instead. But he's near the frozen lake. Oh, there he is. I can see him on the minimap now. Well, somebody's hunting crag boars. That's right in my left ear. Iotic. Here there. I don't know who that is. Greetings, mage. Fine day for hunting, wouldn't you say? I've been having more than a little luck with boars myself. Perhaps you'd like a shot? Guess you have something for me? Thank you, I've been waiting for these letters for quite some time. Unfortunately, these letters aren't all for me. This one is addressed to Graylin Whitebeard. He's not too far away if you'd like to deliver it to him. If I remember correctly, Graylin's camp is down the road to the southeast. No doubt he'll be eager to get his mail. Watch your back. Yep. Interest you on the fight? Nothing like a day of boar hunting, eh? Though here in Coldridge Valley, there are so many boars, it almost takes the fun out of it. No need to get them charging, they're all angry and ready without any help. In fact, recently there have been so many boars in the area it's become dangerous for me to do my daily hunting. Long story short, if you could help me kill some of the boars, I would appreciate it. Well, I can't see what the pants look like since I'm wearing a robe, but let's see. Well, fit you. Uh, let's kill some boars. There's dead boars over here, and well, I'll go after trogs too. There we go. Hey, come over here. Ah. Uh, I don't have any linen, but oh well. Perhaps I'll find another kind soul selling bags. Like the the other day when I was questing with my parents on a on my dwarf hunter. My name's Bossy. Very cool guy. Oh yeah, I'm putting that on. There we go. Oh it's tiny, it's just perfect. Uh. Yeah, I'll just beat you with my staff then. Well, I guess, tell me, what kind of character do you think Maddie's shaping up to be? I know I don't have any mana. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I missed! <laughs> One more. There we go. Too bad I can't use those bracers. So I like the thing, the idea of weapons being, you know, things you wouldn't consider at weapons, like you know, the fish. I must be standing. It wasn't to target something first. I, but I targeted the draw. Well, I haven't met Dorothy myself, but all the people who have been being really kind and making people bags and stuff, they're really cool. I like my gloves, that my gloves match my hair. Not enough match. Ah! How did you resist that? <laughs> this is a very special board. Oh. There we go. Okay. 
I'm already out of water. Uh, I'll get some more, but... Let's see. There's another boar. I need eight more. I should wait a minute and let my uh, mana fill back up. Okay, that's good enough. <laughs> Woohoo! Level three. Okay then. Is that already what I got? Still need six more boars. Uh, smack. <laughs> I don't know, that's just so funny to me. I like it. I mean, I've done it with, you know, retail characters too. Five more boars. Exactly the same, but blue. <laughs> How do I get two red belts? <laughs> okay, three more boars. This is a tusk, okay. Two more boars. Not enough mana. I I know. <laughs> Smack. Oh I missed! I poked it and I missed. <laughs> One more board button stuck. Maybe I really should switch to the new keyboard, but this one is all covered in cat hair. And the new one will probably be covered in cat hair pretty quickly too. <laughs> Smacking it with my staff doesn't do much damage, so at least I'm still attacking it. Okay, that's all the boar.
There's 400, dude. There he is. Took a while for his icon to pop up on the minimap. Talk to me. Excellent. I can go back to my leisurely hunting now. Thank you, Madeline. Be good. Let's put on these new pants, though I have no idea what they look like. Hopefully I can find a nice shirt. Hey you. Oh, it's that guy. Why? <laughs> wait to turn that one in even after I finish it. See any regular trogs? Just the burlies right now. Yeah, definitely not high enough level to get Nori's quest yet. Big Pimpin. Okay then. How are ya? Greetings girl, I'm Greylin Whitebeard. I'm here to examine the threat posed by the growing numbers of trolls in Cold Ridge Valley. What have I found? It's a bit troubling. Is there something I can help you with? Ah, excellent. It's been a while since I received word from Ironforge. My brother Sunir and I were sent to different parts of Dunbar Road to investigate the threat posed by the trolls. Cavern Bro is AFK! Oh my goodness, I haven't seen that in ages. The Senate ha has its hand full with the Trogs, so there's no need for further annoyances. From what I've seen, the Trolls aren't well situated here in Cold Ridge Valley, mostly the Southern Cave. I'd say what the army will, I'd say that the army will not be necessary. A few strong arms should be more than enough. Perhaps you'd like to assist in this endeavor? I have the authority to offer compensation for your help. Excuse me. Ah. Uh. An, a an axe, a hammer, a knife, and a mace, and I can't use any of them. Be good. Okay. Ah. Uh, for some reason, the change after Kata meant that the, the, the whelps were. Um yellow instead of red, so they don't outright attack you. There you go. Can't use that either. Uh, it looks like they attacked the camp over here. Uh... I know there's lots of little trogs somewhere. Aha! Come over and fight me! Aha! Is full. Oh yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> I can't carry any more. At least I'm getting the money. Come on, fight me. So I'm going to turn this in and pick up Felix's quest and sell some stuff. It's just, you know, getting over there is slow. <laughs> At least it sounds nice. No boots! If the problems we've had here are indi 
indicative of what is happening elsewhere in our lands, by Magni's beard we have some troubles ahead of us. I can only hope that the king and the senate are taking steps to deal with the threat the trogs pose. See you soon. Oh yeah! I... Forgot! Just give me my boots! Leather bracers, tusk, bracers, cloak, vest, cloak, ruin pelt, why? Oh yeah. Okay. Watch your back. Need assistance? We drove the trogs out of Numbergrom, but they didn't want all so horribly wrong. Now our home is completely irradiated. And our we gnomes have been scattered all over Dunborough. In my haste to get away from the radiation, I lost all my personal belongings and tools. It was the trolls that got them. They stole my chest, my box, and my bucket of bolts. They took them back to their camp southwest of Anvilmore. I'm no adventurer. Could you find my things and bring them here to me, please? Hey, yeah. You have a great day now. Give me my boots, please! <laughs> I, say, on me. I don't know who that is, but... Boots! Safe <gasps> Level 4! Okay. I think I'm going to stop here d for today. Um, thank you for watching, and... This is Brushfire Dragon signing off!